Well, we're super excited to have everyone back. It was fun. I just came from Starbucks and got my coffee standing in line, saw a lot of familiar faces and many new employees who had never been here before. So, you know, I think that was a, a really fun way to start my day. But, you know, the last few months we've been working on making improvements so that when people return to the office, they could find new things and comfort things. And, you know, we're standing here in the creative room. This was designed so that people who worked at home, you might be working at your in your living room and then you'd get up and go to your kitchen and then you'd want to sit outside and so we said how can we replicate that when they come back to the office so we created this creative room it has lots of comfy seating it has games it has a chalkboard as a community puzzle a lot of people um, they just finished and so a new one will be coming in the next uh, moment but a lot of people like doing puzzles during COVID and so we said well let's have some fun things that are interactive and also ways for new employees to meet each other because it's you know you've been working remotely and you know those departments but you may not know people and other areas so we have shared interests we created a music room so if people who you know love listening to music and they want to blast it loud but maybe they don't want to interrupt with people in their own areas um, we created this where you can sit in a music chair and we have a an old um, record player so you can actually play records and we have a selection of records we also have a, a table that you can plug your phone in it's a bluetooth speaker and so you can blast the music shut the door and you can work from here and so if you love music this is kind of a great place to take a break and you know come in for an hour. Throughout the whole building, we boosted the Wi-Fi because people are used to working on their laptops. And so because people have their laptops, it's designed you can just work wherever you want. You can come up, sit in the purple room, and, and work from your computer here. This is our game room. And so this is where we keep the selection of puzzles so that there's you know dozens of puzzles that are here. It's also a way if you want to um, take a break and you know play a game. We have um, lots of games, and it's kind of a way to meet other people and play cards or chess, checkers, uh, you name it. But the arts and crafts room, and so the arts and crafts room is designed to. Sometimes you might be really stressed and you need to take a break, and you know. So we have those um, patterns where you can actually adult coloring books. You can take sheets and you can color them. There's all sorts of supplies. We also have on the wall here. You can take. One, of them, one or two, whatever you want to do. Them off the wall, and you can paint yours and leave it up there, and we're gonna to add to the wall. And one of the nice things in the middle, we had an employee who actually, this was her office. Liz Kennedy was a beloved employee, and unfortunately she had passed away, but this was a drawing she had done, and so we designed the room around that. We thought that it would kind of uh, have her presence still be here and, and her remembered, and it was work that she had done, and so that kind of is the anchor of this room here in the Arts and Crafts room. So there's lots of supplies and ways to kind of be creative and, and let out a little steam. We also created a Zen room because everyone needs to have a little Zen. And so this room is, it has a massage chair. And I was chatting with an employee who was new and she had come in on her own and she didn't have a desk assigned yet. And she said, you know what I used to do? I would come in here, I'd work for an hour and two, sit in the massage chair, we've got a laptop table, and you can work from here. And uh, you know, so it was really, she loved this room. I think this will be a very popular room. We also have some games so that, you know, there's departments that might get together. Supplier sales had a meeting here. We had some other teams that had some meetings here. And it's kind of fun. We've got ping pong tables and foosball ways that you can kind of relax and have fun with other people. We tried to keep in mind people want to be safe with COVID. We wanted open areas, places where, you know, you could be comfortable and free and open. And so we created an indoor outdoor conference room so that it was a way that we put screens on the conference room so that you can actually open up the screen door when you're leaving in here, bring in outside air. You can still be inside at a, you know, official conference table, but um, it's a nice way to be able to make people who might be a little uncomfortable have some comfort with, um, you know, bringing in the outside air. I think one of my most favorite things that we did, and it's probably because I did a lot of gardening during COVID and I kind of liked kind of uh, growing vegetables and things, is we created an outdoor garden area. This is the workroom here. So this is where the work gets done and things are stored. But and I'll, I'll give you a peek here before we go outside. But so this is where the supplies are kept and, and where the tools are kept in here. And so what uh, what people will be able to do is, you know, be part of a community garden. We've had two garden club meetings so far for volunteers, and so we have about 15 people who are so far part of the community garden for our in-person meetings, and those were before we officially started today. So I'm sure more will join and, um, and want to be part of it. 
two aspects to the garden here. So one is we have a wall where there's terracotta pots, and that was our first project in the last week's garden club. We filled them with soil, and those are going to be individual pots. And so people can have their own, or they can be part of the, the community wall. These come off, and so we have Sharpies that are inside the garden room. You can write your name on it. There's seeds that are in there. We'll have lots of plant options, and you can plant your own. You can write your name on it and take care of that if you really only want to do one little pot. Um, we also have this big garden bed. And this big garden bed, uh, the group is deciding what exactly they want to plant. Uh, there's going to be parts that are going to be vegetables, parts are going to be flowers. So this is you know, going to be a place for a community garden. We also set up a sink. So I think it's kind of fun. You need water if you're going to grow anything. So we have an outdoor sink. It's designed both to wash your hands. So if you're doing any gardening and you don't want to you know, go inside with dirty hands, we have this sink set up. You can wash your hands here. We also have a hose set up. It's a 250 foot hose. And so you're able to you know, bring it all around there and you can water everything. And it's a, we uh, selected this spot because half of the wall will be in the shade. So we can have some shade that need a little less watering some items. And then we have full sun area. Outside view, we actually added booster for our Wi-Fi, And so we actually, you can sit out here during the day. This is an ASI only space. And it's designed so that you can sit and do your work. Like a lot of people really enjoyed taking their laptop for a couple hours and working outside. We wanted to make sure people had that opportunity here as well. And so this is set up. There's also a conference table that's an outdoor conference table. So if you're having a group meeting and it's a beautiful day like today, it'd be a great place to sit outside. I think one of the other things I'm really excited about is in the hallways, we added the core values. And these are things that Tim really helped write and design and create for us. And I think they really embody what we are as ASI. And I think, you know, here's one, we're like a family. And I think we really believe it. And I think that's one of the reasons I'm so excited to have everyone back in the office is because, you know, we love to know our employees. We love to get to know them. We want them to get to know us. And we really, we feel like a family. And so I think these core values, when you walk them through the hallways, will kind of remind you about what's important to us as a company. And we are, we do have fun. We are willing to be as silly as we are serious. And, you know, we are super excited to have everyone back. And we're now in another one of the special rooms we created. This is a, the green and orange room, for lack of a better name. And this is really designed as an open lounge area. Uh, we designed it so it's right off of the corridor coming from the cafeteria so that if you get your food and you want to kind of sit in a fun area with everyone, it's designed like a Starbucks or with high top tables and low top tables. It's also an area where if you're working at your desk and you feel like, gosh, I'd like to get up and move to another location and work somewhere, the Wi-Fi is boosted in here so you can sit at a high top table, have your laptop, and we have charging stations over there for your phone. So if you happen to have forgotten your charger, you can plug your phone in over at the uh, charging station. We also have three offices that are here, and these are fully plug and play offices. Meaning if you need to make a um, call to a client and you want to have you know, some privacy or maybe you want to have a meeting with someone, the two, you know, one-on-one, -on -one, they're designed, they can be checked out just like the conference rooms. And so it's interesting, there's someone in there right now. And they have two screens. You can bring your laptop, plug right into it. You can reserve it online just like you reserve a conference room. And so these are offices that, you know, you can use uh, if you need some privacy. And